we build really cool trucks for really cool people and really cool people build them. So we're just a group of kind of automotive misfits that overnight somehow got the NASDAQ. We take a British classic vehicle and we Americanize it with customization and American drivetrains. And the clients at the center of it, we did something very unique in automotive. We said, for once, let's put the client at the center of it. And more importantly, put mechanics at the center of it. Let mechanics be mechanics. So our story was that we put two very important people at the center of automotive manufacturing. Uh, we designed one-on-one -on -one vehicles for one-on-one -on -one clients with one-on-one -on -one mechanics building it. No vehicle is the same. Um, we're in a pursuit of perfection that we'll never get. It's, it's never an endpoint. It's a GPS system so we can structure our mechanics and everybody that works in the business. There are other elements to this business that we should integrate in terms of financial services, um, vendor supply chain, um, so that we just become a, a, a self-sufficient ecosystem. And I think classic car restoration has been around for over 20 years at this kind of scale. And I think we've all just done it in isolation. And I think there's an opportunity on the NASDAQ and with public visibility, just to put it all in one big sand pit and play happily together. This kind of NASDAQ uh, means, you know, what a great platform. I don't think there's a better platform in the world. It's, this is where we can put our product, our incredible unique product, um, right at the center of the world and, and have platforms to have a broader audience and share the remarkable skills of our workforce, you know, US workforce that we've created and the unique product that we build for our clients here. And, you know, we build clients' dreams. So I guess that's what the NASDAQ is for us. It's a dream platform. I think the world is, is full of innovators that never get given the platform. And I think um, self-belief is one of the things you're not going to give up on. I think um, incredible discipline. You've got to stick to it. And I just think stick to something true and be human about it. Just make it um, simple, take the noise out of business, but don't overcomplicate business. And I think the Nasdaq's a great platform for innovators to come on board. Innovators have first and foremost got to believe in themselves and the product and never let anybody else distract you from that. Be true to what you think is right and you'll go through probably more pain, but the, the other side of it is a really good place to be.